Okay, everybody, so I've um, spent the last couple of hours in my garage. I'm actually getting pretty close to getting this exactly the way I want it to be. Um, it's, it still looks like a mess, but it only kind of appears that way. Uh, there are things that I need to change to make this functional. I have my table saw here, and uh, it's been on a, uh, a moving platform so that I can move it around the garage. I'm going to make this permanent. I'm going to put it right in the middle of the garage door, uh, just clearing the garage door. I used to use this as my outfeed table. It's an old ping pong table. So the whole idea was to keep everything mobile so I can move things around, but uh, I'm going to make stuff permanent. That's going to be thrown away, destroyed. I'm going to build a permanent outfeed table. It's going to be only four feet long but that's all I really need I do have other ways for the wood to go out stay firm onto the table I've got plenty of stuff here I've got three quarter inch melamine that I'm going to use as the top uh, a lot of boxes need to be just um, thrown away um, <clears throat> I've started putting my work stuff in cubbies here underneath my radial arm saw so, the, you know, if I want electrical, I could just pull this electrical box. Uh, this is plumbing over here. This is automotive. I'm going to try to try and find some place for that because I don't spend a lot of time on automotive. Just don't have the time anymore. So, and um, I'm going to empty those over there uh, and build some more cabinets. Not cabinets, but shelves on this side to put stuff on. So, up, everything up and away, up on the walls. Uh, easy to get a hold of so uh, the floor is going to be clear this goes into the front room eventually it's it's our stereo cabinet uh, in the front room is a whole bunch of stuff right now from uh, our cabin our storage unit so and it has places to go I just have to find time to do it we were supposed to hang a door today but uh, we priced it out for the guy and he didn't like the price so uh, and we've been told, you know, they'll always try and uh, lower the price on you, but uh, we're at a point where we don't want to just give a really, really low price just to get the work because we're not making any money off of it that way. So we're going to stay firm on our prices and uh, uh, on what we need to survive. Tomorrow, there might be a job or two tomorrow, and uh, Dave's going to come over. And we're going to work on the upstairs, work on stuff here. Maybe it'll help me with my table saw. <sighs> and, uh, yeah, make the, the pretty much the center of this room easier to access. Ladders may go out on the side of the house. We've got a couple of them in here need to go out. Um, when it's all done, I'll be very happy to show it to you because I'm getting very excited about just how... Um, organized I'm getting in here so I just hope after all this organization the the business just isn't taken off and I'm gonna have to sell the place which means removing all the stuff again so we'll see how it works out Val has been sick all day I don't even know if we did a good morning I kind of don't remember t doing a good morning because she's been sick she actually has been throwing up which is something she is not supposed to be able to do with her um, was it her stomach uh, sleeve, her gastric sleeve surgery? But she has thrown up, and uh, that's that's not good. So I think we think it's the flu or something. Hopefully, I don't get it, and I can continue working. Hey, everybody! I hope you're all having a great day. I slept most of the day. You've been sick today. Yesterday, I think I got a stomach bug. I think I got a stomach bug, but um, I'm feeling a lot better since I slept most of the day. Uh, excuse me. <sighs> Had to yawn. Um, yeah, I have to get up and go with Kirsty tomorrow morning, um, so I better be feeling better. <laughs> um, but no, I'm doing okay right now. Uh, 
I was going to try and color Christmas cards like I did last year for everybody, and I just can't get into coloring Christmas stuff right now. I <laughs> don't know why. So. Well, it's not Christmas yet, first of yeah, all. Yeah, but I have to color them to mail them out. Well, yeah, but still. And I you just. Have to, we're not, I'm not in a Christmas mood yet. Yeah, but I can't mail them out until I color them. You know what yes, I mean? And I just dear. can't get into the mood to color them. So, um. <coughs> it's probably not going to be colored Christmas cards this year. Yeah. I'll probably go and buy a box of Christmas cards and mail them <laughs> out, which I don't like to do, but oh well. Anyway, um, Kirstie's going to stop by in a little while. She's going to the ranch first, and then she's going to stop by and say hello. Sorry, guys, I can't stop yawning. Right now, I'm coloring something for Kirsty. Um, so that's about it. Um, I, I'm so tired, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, my medication for my stomach makes me extremely, extremely sleepy. So, uh, you have anything to add, Kev? No, I got Boomer here wanting my attention. Now, Fweckles just came in. Hello, Fweckles. Mm-hmm. Hello, Fweckles. <laughs> so, we're going to go ahead and call it an evening. Um, Kevin's got some work to do on the laptop, I mean, on the computer. And I'm going to get And I'm just going to color um, some of the stuff that I do have. And call it an early evening because I have a feeling I'm going to go back to sleep as soon as Kirsty leaves. Mm -hmm. So we hope you enjoyed a little bit of something that you may have seen in our video today. Get those yawns out, baby, and wake up. <laughs> if you did, please give us a favorite, give us a thumbs up, sh leave us a comment down below. I will respond to each and every one of you. We love to hear from you guys. Absolutely love it. And... <laughs> Please share our video with your family and friends. But most of all, Say goodbye, Boomer. Yeah. Say goodbye. Yeah.